Hey, what's up guys? Damien again here from Driving Safely with Janice Driving School. Basically, what we're going to do for you guys in today's video is just give you a bit of a rundown as to what to expect if the examiner asks you guys for a starting procedure. Alright, so basically, what you guys are going to do, as soon as you climb in the car, this, they very seldomly ask you guys for this. But if they do, they'll generally ask you this either as soon as you climb in your car to do your interior inspection, or as soon as you've done or completed your interior inspection. So basically, as soon as you climb in your car, as per the other video key, in the ignition, cluster lights on, your car is on. At this point, they may then ask you to do it, or once you've done your full interior inspection, as per the other video, they'll then ask you to do it. So basically, your starting procedure is just explaining to the examiner as to what you're expected of, or what you're expected to do before actually driving your vehicle. So all you're going to do is you're going to start off by saying, I've checked my cluster, all my gauges are on and they are working. My seat belt is on, my car has an automatic choke, my handbrake is up, and my car's gears are in neutral. So that's all they really expect from you guys, um, is just to give them a bit of an explanation as to what is expected before you actually drive your vehicle. So it's handbrake, neutral, seat belt, cluster lights or gauges are working and on a newer model car you will have to state to them that your car has an automatic choke. On older model cars, you don't have to state that because they won't have an automatic choke. But basically, guys, like I said, again, a really short video just to explain to you what a starting procedure is if they do ask you this on the day of your test. At any point, whether they ask you before or after, during, this is the starting procedure that you'll give to them. Guys, if this video was helpful and you enjoyed this video, please do like and subscribe and share all over social media. And we hope to see you soon on the next video. Enjoy the rest of your day and drive safe.